Hey guys, I can't wait to open Pokemon Shield. I'm going to open Pokemon Shield cards now. Let's do that. Last episode, we opened up a Pokemon Sword Booster Box. But lucky for us, this set is split into two 60 card halves, not including the secret rares. So today, we are going to be taking a look at Pokemon Sh We interrupt this broadcast to bring you a much more superior product. Get ready for the Pokemon Card Game Limited Collection Master Battle Set. Pre-order only, sold out everywhere. Sorry guys, the announcer says I've got to take a look at this. This arrived. Oh, it's like I'm doing surgery. I had opened up a Pokemon Sword, and today is the following day, I was about to open up the Pokemon Shield, and this came in the mail. I had to put everything on hold, because oh, this is something special. This is a love letter and a farewell goodbye to the Sun and Moon Era, and my god does it look premium. Limited Collection Master Battle Set. This looks like something designer. Now, this has some of the greatest promo cards in it of all time. I think the Pikachu that's in here might be my favorite ever. I haven't seen it in person yet, but I'm about to take a look. There's the two cards. We'll get to them. Oh my god, that is heavy. But first, let's see what we have at the front here. What is this? Oh no, he's opening it. This isn't made of Miltank leather, is it? Wow. Pokemon. They just keep outdoing themselves. I don't know what you're supposed to store in that. Ah! Perhaps this! A gorgeous playmat with all that holographic goodness! Oh my lord! Surely it's nice to take a break from all that kiddie stuff and start swinging with the big rich Japanese CEOs. All right, so that sits just perfectly in there like so. Imagine going to a tournament and whipping that out. All right, guys, I guess I should let you have a little peek at some of the cards. I've been waiting for this for quite a while. It's like an end of year special. It was on pre-order for a few months. We're gonna take off the top sheet. We're gonna take a look at the coin. Keeping it simple, keeping it classy. Then we have a burn and poison token. Then we have some reflective, nice holographic sleeves in the same style. I'm gonna open them. Actually, no, I'm not. Ah, I'm fighting with the demon and the angel on my shoulder. I'm gonna do it. I'll keep these for my absolute favorite cards to slide in. Okay, now, I'm going to look at the cards now. But first, we're gonna take some precautions. Okay, I don't actually think I need these. I don't even know if these specific gloves would help. They're even a little bit powdery on the skin. It's probably worse for holding cards with. I don't actually care about using these, but I do want to get some gloves for a future episode, some point when I open up like a very, very expensive old box. If you guys can point me in the right direction of what like your favorite magic channel uses or whatever, I know there are some channels that are into the whole glove thing. I just have no idea what ones and where to go. Let me know below. But without further ado, let us get some powder on these promos. Okay, this is going, this, okay. Check out. <laughs> what do you think, guys? A celebration, a goodbye to the sun and moon era with all your favorite sun and moon boys and girls. I don't know if the promo number is particular to anything in Japanese culture or something like that, but it's number 401. I think the final sun and moon card. These gloves actually seem okay. We're gonna slide it in there. Adds an even nicer holographic border to it. Okay, now there is an even cooler promo that you've probably seen in the thumbnail, but it looks incredible in real life. I'm staring at it right now, boys. It doesn't get much better than this. We're gonna take a look at that in just a moment. What else do we have in this goodie box? Okay, this thing is thick. Ooh, man, she got that wagon. A deck box in a similar, this is so durable. There is the front, as you'd expect. I don't think there's even any dividers or anything in that. I don't think we really need to open that. I'm not gonna use it. I'm just gonna sit it up there. Now the funny thing about this box is there's not a whole lot of stuff in it besides the two cards. So I feel like to make this, it wasn't that expensive for them. 
but it was selling for a very expensive price and it's already reselling for dumb amounts. Now up next we have an even smaller card carrier. This one looks like maybe it could fit your deck and the other one's just for excess. And then maybe you could hold these in there. These are some dice. Very solid. They're, I think they're metal. Those are like metal dice. Damage dice. Then up next, we have, they love their pens, don't they, the Japanese? We just opened one of these recently in the banker episode. <laughs> and the pen, oh, very nice, very heavy pen. Imagine tuning into a channel to watch a man open and review a Japanese banker's pen from 2017. But, but here we have a pen for the public. A zebra pen, it says Pokemon card game on it. And it's very small. Now lastly, before we go into the final promo, we have this very interesting GX counter that's uh, that's a metal one, and it's this jet black color. Not seen them do anything like that before. Woo! All right, let's get it over and done with, then we can do all the excess stuff. I don't want to blue ball you for too long. Here is the other promo card, guys. Oh my god! What is that design? That is incredible! Look at it! Look at that! Pikachu, you've got to finish the year on a Pikachu. He has rainbow lightning with the thick border just coming off the border of the card itself as well. Tapu Lele up in the corner. We've got Buzzwall in the background. And we've got a big Zekrom, which I guess is to, you know, strengthen their tag team lore. And this one is... Uh, the promo just behind the other one, number 400, Sun and Moon. Goodbye, Sun and Moon. Hello, Sword and Shield. Let's see if we can get, uh, a Google Translate here. Bikatu! Electric power! That's gotta be close. Throw coins once and match opponent's battle. This looks like a bootleg card. I could design bootleg cards with Google Translate. This one says, well, that looks like how a Japanese person would say Alola. A roller, a roller's fellow. So I'm pretty sure this says Alolan, the Alolan gang. But there you go, guys. Two of my favorite cards I've seen in a long time. That Pikachu is really something special. I hope they, I hope they do more stuff like this going forward. They're really pleasing all markets. Like the Japanese, you guys are killing it. I mean, you're killing those whales, but you're killing the Pokemon game as well. Keep it up. Not the whale killing, the Pokemon stuff. All right, it wouldn't be a sun and moon celebratory video without some sun and moon burning shadows. Ooh, look at this subpar coin. Here's the code. Here's the Cosmog promo. Here is a pack. Let's see what we get. Man, packs are hard to open with gloves. And here is the code from the back. One, two, three to the front. And getting rid of th this, I forgot. We've got Lana, Tormenting Spray, Charmeleon, Porygon, Sork, Oddish, Charmander, Meryl, Toxic Croak, and on the end, a Dusk Noir holographic. Can you imagine if we got a Charizard on a video like this celebrating the Sun and Moon era? My god, it would be so fitting. Come on, Pokemon gods, please. Getting rid of fire energy, burn the fire for the Charizard. That's what I always say. That's going to be a noble sacrifice. Here he comes. Here he comes. Dark Rise, I reverse. And then, ooh, looking good, Charizard. Last one. Let's see. Here is code. One, two, three. Here is Leaf. Be gone, Leaf. Here is Thick Wick. Here is Lunatone. Gloom. Crab Roller. Meowth. Stuffle. Pan Sage. Crow Gunk, what's he looking for? In K as our reverse. And on the end, we're gonna finish this one with a Galissapod. Wow, so epic. Okay, you know what? I've decided it's time for. I've decided it's time for Max Mofo's Postcard Collection! It's the segment on the show where typically we open up postcards and other prizes won from the children's slot machine gambling function on the Pokemon Center Online. Now, recently we have been going through these postcards, which I've got off eBay, which isn't the norm for the channel, but it's been a nice journey. Now this one, uh, again, I haven't looked at any of these. I'm looking at them first time now. We've got another JR Japanese train line Pokemon 
Jirachi movie, Pikachu movie postcard. Then we have another one, which looks like the next two, a 2003 JR line postcards. Here we go. Okay, that one is pretty cool. Very cute. And then up next, we've got an, another one of the same sort of scene unfolding here. I don't know how I feel about Pikachu keeping Torchic and Mudkip as slaves. Free the slaves! Unshackle them! That's cruel. And lastly, we have... What is this one? Ooh, this thing... What, does this fold out? That's a rip-off. That ain't a po- Oh, you're supposed to actually cut the postcard. Oh, it tears off! Well, I'll be! A Mudkip ride. That's right, it's Pokemon Park. 2005. That's not all for today. We actually have some stuff from the Pokemon Center in recent times. And yes, we have some sword and shield ones. These will hold your bits of paper or your tax documents. There's that one. Then we have the same legendary. Then we've got the sword legendary. I mean the shield legendary. Then the shield legendary. And then we've got a duplicate of one we've seen before with Ho-Oh and the dogs. And a Lugia is on the back there, but we've already seen it. Suck my ass. It's not my fault. I keep winning all those children's gambling prizes. Right. Thank you so much for watching, guys. This has been a very special episode. We will continue with the Pokemon Shield box that I still need to do. If you would like to buy any of my merch, uh, you can look at all this gorgeous merch here. You can buy that. Christmas is just around the corner. Link is at the top of the description, or you can go to max.shirts with a Z dot cool. If you buy anything else on that website, you can use code MOFO to save 10%. And finally, and most importantly, there's a new episode out of the Sword Let's Play over on MaxMofo Games. So go suck on that. And goodbye for now.